karibu tena sana mpenzi every single day i'm gonna make something great that's my way every single tena sana mpenzi mtazamaji katika kipindi hiki cha mapi mke nyumbani Uh, hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel and if you're new to my channel welcome to my channel so on today's video i thought i should do something different and um there's one chapati video i did and then i have always wanted to do this like butternut chapati or malenge chapati or pumpkin chapati but this is butternut so i've always wanted to do this video but uh I haven't had a chance or I forgot or anyway yeah but today I have that chance to do the video so I'm going to make butternut chapati and I've already cut this piece and boiled so it's already here so I'm going to uh, make uh, I'm going to mash this So I'm going to take some stuff. I'm going to take a And I'm gonna add some salt. I usually add uh, sugar onto my chapati, little sugar, but um, butternut is very sweet, so I'm adding salt only, salt to taste. I think at this point I can add also some. Then I'm going to mash this. So I'm going to mash this into a very thick paste and then I will be back I will be ready. Ready here the thick paste as you can see. It was very easy to do that. Uh so because I've already added salt I won't need any more. Here I'm going to add all purpose flour that is one this later that is 50 ml and I don't want to make so many chapatis I want to make approximately I'm gonna continue to knead this until it's very fine, and then I will be right back. You know, it's very small, as I said. I don't want to make so much. And then I'm gonna start rolling them so that I can start spinning them. So I'm not gonna record rolling because I have already done a video doing that. So if you want to see how I roll my chapatis round, uh, because I'm working on this other side and the camera is facing this side and I don't want to uh, destroy this setting here that I've made otherwise I might drop the camera so I'm um, gonna roll my chapatis and then but you will see me cooking here so if you want to see how I roll my chapatis and how I made that do very soft like that because it's, it's soft if you want to see how I made that Uh, you will see here up here there is like I let's say I so you click there there is the video that I made chapati step by step uh, and you will show uh, it shows how I needed the dough from the scratch and how I made it round so I'm gonna continue making my my round my shapes and then I will be back all right 
here I have the rolled dough already like they're like this and I'm rolling them into round shape and then we're gonna place in our pan and start cooking so I've already made one here look don't worry when the color is like light like this when it's it's cooked it's very yellow and I haven't added any color only the butternut so when it starts to dry on top uh, you're gonna apply some oil and then when you see the bubbles here you will know that your chapati is getting ready on the other side so this I had mentioned on the other video that you will see so so now it's ready on back side or almost and we are gonna flip it like that that I did and I'm gonna oil them about this side I won't add too much oil just lay it and when you see this uh, bubbles like when it's when the air is forming that means you have already gotten your layers so because I don't know if so many people know that chapati uh, yes it's about the taste but the layers matters very much like the more layers you have the most the more ch the the tastier chapati is so, because I'm supporting my camera, and I want to be very careful so I don't drop it. I said earlier, if you click here, here, you will see the video where I rolled my dolls to round shapes. Yeah, also to this part. So this one is ready. Then we're gonna place our next. Not that. You can try to. No, it's going to. To do like this. <clears throat> Until. You see, it's very like wet, so when it dries, you're gonna apply it, and then the bubbles will start forming. Then you're gonna apply some oil. They're not too thirsty, you know, but on the lower side, I don't apply so much because I've already applied on this one. So, once it place it there, and then it melts very fast. It so, this is ready. I don't know if my voice is uh, loud enough because my recorder is very far from where I am, but um, I'm gonna make now one more and then I will. Sure. You like I'm gonna make this one and I'm here. So you don't wait for the bubbles to form and then you apply the oil. Like I'm insisting so that you can take step by step in case you forgot the step that I did earlier. So you see the bubbles. This bubble stands here, but it's getting ready. So when you see that you have to be very fast, so you don't buy me a chapati. Yeah, and this is uh this is Kenyan chapati. You see how it's coming so nicely, like yellow. I'm telling you, the smell is very, very nice. I think the butternut makes it smell nice. It's like when you're roasting butternut, I mean, it smells like a uh, sweet potato. These are the kind of chapatis that I make once in a while and they turn out very, very good. But when I make for other people, they're not like this. I don't know why. I was bored today and then I, I, I I'm feeling sickly. 
sinkish but then I decided like no I have to wake up and do something so I went shop and bought some stuff and here I am spinning chapatis yeah so I'll come back when I have finished it uh, so here are the chapatis um, I don't know this is still hot I'm gonna put something I have to improvise so that you guys can see yeah so before I show you how they look inside uh, I want to add you please like this video give it a thumbs up if you're a hater give it this I'll know you're a hater and if uh, if you like it share it with your friends so that they can see how I made this chapati and if they want to try so that they can they can they can know how to make the same chapatis like I made don't be mean with information also comment down below what you want me to do next or come on my uh, Instagram and direct message me DM me what you want me to, to do next and I'll definitely do it give me a challenge so um, and lastly don't forget to subscribe and click on the notification you see that bell down here you sub, you you click like that and then when up when every time I post a new video you'll be the first person to see that video so I'm gonna show you now how this chapati looks inside like it's um, they're so beautiful and yeah they are very soft see and oops see the layers I was talking about this layer the layers the layers they're very ready inside so thank you